When a spark or other ignition source ignites particulate in a vessel, a fireball develops as material burns and grows at an exponential pace. The pressure front expands as the fireball grows, reaching the explosion vent. The explosion vent ruptures at a preset pressure, limiting the stress on the vessel and allowing it to maintain structural integrity, while also releasing that pressure and allowing the fireball to vent into a safe area outside the facility. Alternatively, when the process cannot be vented safely outside, the explosion vent ruptures and directs the fireball into a flameless venting device. The flames are extinguished as they pass through the flame arresting screens, allowing pressure release but preventing dangerous flames from entering the work area, protecting personnel, and preventing secondary explosions. It is also necessary to isolate the deflagration, preventing the transmission of the flame into interconnected vessels. As the fireball grows, the detector rapidly captures the pressure spike and sends a signal to the control module, which tracks the pressures, capturing four readings every millisecond. The system alarms at a preset level or can be configured to alarm on rate of rise and sends an activation signal to the gas cartridge actuator on the suppression model and isolation devices. The system maintains a history of the event for future reference. The gas cartridge actuator drives the piston on the isolation valve closing the slide gate and providing mechanical isolation in the duct.